Bismillahirrahmanirrahim welcome back to my channel and uh, after four months I am going to make the videos again so I really apologize from all of you that I was not able to make the videos as I was very much busy but uh, now I am back again and uh, yes now I will be continuously making the videos for you guys so guys in this video I am just going to give you uh, a walkthrough of how we can create uh, an app using the SQLite database and how can we uh, use the primary key and the, for and the foreign key for our uh, two tables so basically we will create the two tables and then we will link them with the foreign key okay so uh, that is the main thing that I want to make sure that you uh, go through all of them right guys alright guys so here uh, what I am going to show is first of all I show you the demo and then we will uh, go through the source code so here I am now going to connect my Samsung flow uh, so I am going to connect my phone so that's how I will connect and okay so I will come back again after I connect my smartphone alright guys so I have connected my phone with this device uh, with the laptop and here I uh, open my app which I have made and there we are able to see all the saved uh, data in from our uh, SQLite uh, database so we are fetching the data and here if I create uh, if I click on that and if I let me write new category so if I click on add so you will be able to see new category here okay, alright and suppose if we want to uh, click on any one of them suppose if I want to click on third so if I click on that and there you can see we have the sub categories here this is hello third one and third so suppose if I write uh, if I click a sub at uh, the category here and if I write let me write something like anything here and if I click on add so there you are able to, to see the sub category here so if we go back and if we click on second there we are able to see the subcategories of that particular category so that was the uh, app which I am working right now and I will also make uh, the full tutorial series on that app but first of all I have to complete that project alright so here now we I show you what I am going uh, I am writing the code and here you can see we have the main activity okay so first of all then we open the app we open the, the main activity here and after this we are uh, we have created this uh, database helper class alright so inside this uh, database helper class we have uh, I have created the two tables okay these are the uh, two tables which I have created if I show you the uh, SQL query for this so there I have created the create table then I have the create uh, the table category which I have defined the variables here as well and then we I have defined the integer primary key auto increment and then after this I have created this SQLite uh, the second table and that is the sub category table here I have put the categories uh, ID then I have integer auto increment then we have the title and for the foreign key I have used this alright so I have the ID uh, of that uh, the first table then we I set the integer and then we write foreign key into ID of that uh, particular table and then I click reference and inside that we have to uh, write with the name of the table and inside that we again type the ID here so that's how we create the foreign key here so after we cre have created the foreign key now uh, here we uh, suppose we have created these two tables so now the, f the first thing is how we add the table so here this is the add, add function that I have used so we are just adding the title and uh, we are only using the db.insert method so we are only inserting the title here so after we are inserting the, the title so we want to fetch all the categories so in order to find fetch all the categories here I have this created the method get all category so inside this uh, method I have used the select static from the table and then I have used the do and do while 
loop here and we are uh, easily fetching the id and the title of that table and we are storing them inside our category array list and then we are uh, returning the array list so here i am uh, calling it and uh, here i have used the recycler view for that and then we have used the adapter here all right and we are uh, and that's how we are showing the this one so uh, i have another uh, uh, concept that i want to teach you but i will do that in my next part of the video so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you and goodbye